Hey team, today we are taking a look at Slime Rancher 2, which is going to be the sequel to the original, which over 15 million fans worldwide have been able to enjoy. Slime Rancher 2 is set to be released on September 22nd on PC and Xbox, but let's go ahead and jump in and take a look at everything we know so far about Slime Rancher 2. So Minami Park have released some information online uh, so far for us to take a look at and get excited for it, but they've kept a lot of secrets for us to kind of discover. At first it doesn't appear like we are part of the Far Far Ranch anymore. We are on a brand new island called Rainbow Island and it is very apparent with how brightly colored and almost like there's forests all throughout it whereas the Far Far Ranch used to be kind of uh, dry, desolate and kind of uh, scary to kind of play in at some places. So our new home is going to be this conservatory right here which looks like a grand uh, atrium. Right in the middle of it you've got a giant tree and what appears to be about eight plots that we can uh, put our slimes or grow vegetables and uh, even run our plots of water. During this trailer you can see this, the market screen where you sell your plots. It only has about 16 on there but it looks like it could go up to about 30 to 35 different types of plots that we could sell. As we play through the game there is four new confirmed slimes. We're gonna have the bat, the angler, the butterfly and the bunny. It does appear from their cover art also that we could potentially be getting a uh, raccoon of some sorts. So Starlight Strand appears to be almost like a starter zone uh, where it's a large wide open field with uh, pink and bunny um, slimes that we can see so far and it appears to go from biome to biome. We're going to be using these uh, water canals or water biomes. Rainbow Fields appears like it's going to have uh, some butterfly slime in it as well. Um, potentially a nice little starter zone, nice and bright, which then takes us into what could be a little bit darker, the Ember Valley, which seems like it's a blown up volcano. We're going to be running through there and capturing uh, this could be where our bats are located. With Slime Rancher 1 you did have to craft machines to extract resources from the from the earth. Uh, it does appear that uh, we won't be doing that anymore. We do see that there are resources built into the walls that we can suck out um, and there's also what appears to be uh, honey that drips from the ceilings that we can maybe collect. Uh, and collect some beeswax. There has not been any confirmation just yet on how the UI is going to be set up. Uh, with Slime Rancher 1 obviously we did have our four slots down the bottom with the water um, as our fifth and it does appear from our trailer here that we do have a little bit of a display on the slime gun itself uh, so every time we're about to shoot a slime it is displaying what it is that we're about to shoot. Needless to say I am very excited for Slime Rancher 2 uh, I've got over 100 hours on Slime Rancher 1 and I will definitely be playing the day that it releases. If you guys are interested in following my channel, please hit the like button and uh, consider subscribing. Until next time, I will see everyone later.